Hey guys, it's Conf Kali Studios here, and today is December 31st, the last day of 2022. And of course, we are spending it at Great Adventure once again. We did it last year. We're back here this year. As you can tell, it's a very crappy day out. Uh, the a parking attendant told us the fireworks are not happening tonight, which I kind of expected. Honestly, I can see the park closing early because it's just very bad weather. It's not particularly rainy. It's just very foggy and misty, so... We'll see how it goes. Looking to get five rides on Jersey Devil so I could have 100 for the 2022 season. So we'll see you guys inside. We're inside the park and you can see it's kind of tough to see Joker with all this fog. We're probably gonna head right and go towards Nitro and Jersey Devil. First up for today is gonna be a ride on Justice League. I got 360, you got 291. I just did four rides on Justice League, and I have, I think I cracked the code. Five. Five. No, it was four. It was four rides. He can't figure out what I was doing. Yeah, but I'm still not. But I'm in the first screen, out. I got 60,000. Hey, what's up? Now we're going to head over there for some rides on Jersey Devil, as I'm almost at uh, 100 rides for the season. So the plan is to hit that, and it actually looks like it's running pretty decent. So we'll see you guys over there. We just got off of seven rides in a row on Jersey Devil. As you can see, there is literally nobody here. I was able to ride it in the back row every time, and the reason I stopped at seven was because that actually means that was my 400th ride ever on Jersey Devil. And on my fifth ride, that was my 100th ride of the season on Jersey Devil. And it's actually running really fast, considering there's no more than six people on every train we were on. So it was really good overall, and yeah, I'm very surprised it's running this fast. How's Jersey Devil? I was running really fast. I was really surprised. The park was absolutely dead. The, the fog coming off the frozen lake just gives everything such an eerie feeling. It's just Jersey crazy. Down the just got some fat burger, and now we're gonna go do a ride or two, or however many, on Nitro. So we just got off of what is going to be our final coaster of the 2022, well, not season, but of 2022. It was Nitro. We did six rides in a row in the back row, and it was running good. Got nice airtime, and the fog, of course, was crazy. Riding any coaster in the fog is really cool because you just get a whole new perspective of the ride. Dad, how was Nitro? Oh, it was really cool, especially with the fog. It just changes it up. It kind of reminds me of Fright Fest. But, uh, really good time. Last coaster of 2022. I also forgot to mention the park is closing early. It's closing at five. It's around 4:20 right now. We weren't really planning to stay very long, anyways. It's very dead, so I don't. I'm not surprised that the park is closing this early. Um, so we're probably gonna go grab some peppermint ice cream and head out. And they have also rescheduled the New Year's fireworks for tomorrow night, meaning Sunday, January 1st. So if you are planning to come to the park tomorrow, because I hope I had this video out today. Definitely go check out the fireworks because they're usually really, really good here.
that? How's that peppermint cone? This is really good. This has got to be Six Flags Blue Ice Cream alternative. They should keep it year round. They keep it year round. If you guys round. are watching, which I'm sure you probably are. This is good. This thing is so good. It is so foggy out. We're all the way over here at the boardwalk and you still cannot see King Da Kai. It's that foggy out. Can't even see Superman from here. You can barely see El Toro's turnaround from here too. Barely. For today's El Toro update, through the fog, you might be able to see some missing track over there. This is really creepy. Can barely see log flume. You see nothing on the other side of the lake. You see the lady of the lake. And you can barely see Joker. That is going to do it for our brief visit here to Great Adventure for New Year's Eve. Uh, we, will, we should be back here tomorrow for New Year's Day, uh, but it was very nice and dead today. I know it was ridiculously packed yesterday, so it must be nice for them to have a bit of a dead day afterwards. But of course, today being the final day of 2022, I want to thank you all for watching my videos throughout the year. This year has seen tremendous growth for Hollywood Studios more than any year past by far. And if you haven't already, definitely go check out both year in review videos. One is more of an edited one that shows all of our experiences throughout the year, while the other one is with all the people that are normally in the vlogs, like Tom, Ace, and more, giving how their year was. So definitely go check those out after this if you haven't already. Of course, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in 2023. Adios.